Hey guys, welcome back to Honest Product Review. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel, guys. In today's video, we're going to review amazing adapter, amazing to you guys, with the help of which you can, guys, use regular R134A AC refrigerant, guys, in a system that requires R1234YF, guys. So with that adapter, guys, you can do that. Stay with us, we're going to cover that. You can find, guys, the link and where we got it from in the description of the video below, guys. So, quick introduction now, guys. As you know, we have a channel, guys, called Auto Repair, guys, and on that channel, guys, we take our cars completely apart and we have more than 200 videos on every car so please check it out guys we'll have the link in the description of the video below and we'll teach you how to fix your car for free so let me show you guys okay about that adapter guys what it looks like and we will explain guys how that system works now and how you can do it now many vehicles guys nowadays okay when you open the hood somewhere on the hood or the radiator support you will see the okay what kind of refrigerant the system uses ours is r1234yf which is pretty new stuff guys and uh, really hard to get to stuff still expensive you will need a special uh, special fuel holes so you have to spend quite a bit of money if you need to get some we'll have the link in the description of the video below and you can see where you can get them for a more affordable price but still not as affordable as a regular r134 r134 a can guys and with the help of that adapter you can do that i will still recommend to go only with the original stuff guys okay but i'm just demonstrating that you can do it with that adapter but always guys consult your manual and always make sure that it's approved for your vehicle even though we have been using it in uh, vehicles that we service here at the shop for more than two years with no problem guys but always consult your manual and don't quote us on that so this is the adapter guys now if you guys try to connect your regular r134a holes to the uh, low pressure port of your vehicle guys it's not going to work why simply guys because okay this thing this is the low pressure port okay because the uh that r1234y uh f adapter guys is way bigger than the regular refrigerant and it doesn't fit but with the help of that adapter now okay what i can do i will go ahead unscrew the cap watch now okay you get it like that push it on top and release it guys okay but you cannot mix the two coolants guys stay with us and i'm going to explain more about that you can see it's installed and now i can connect my r134a can guys with no problems okay you can see and how we chose the pressure and everything so now we can recharge our system now uh, people said that you cannot mix the two refrigerants you can have one of each kind so you can read charge the system with the original stuff if you have the original stuff and you need to add some you have to have it drained by a professional technician guys take it to a shop where they vacuum it down you don't want to release it in the atmosphere because there is a big fine and it kills the atmosphere and later you can put the r134a the two do not mix okay so uh what i recommend if you go to a shop and you have r134a in your system tell them because otherwise if they vacuum it and put it in a container with the other stuff it's not going to mix so always you have to uh, let them know another thing guys i always recommend to use the uh, original stuff we'll have the link in the description of the video below and we'll have the link for the adapter as well if you need to check it out so hopefully guys the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you guys next time